New developments in the case of an NFL player, New England Patriot Aaron Hernandez, and a murder investigation. A man's body was found near his home. Police have been there twice and have not ruled him out as a suspect. ABC's Rob Nelson joins us from in front of Hernandez's home just outside of Boston. Good morning, Rob. Uh, good morning to you, Robin. As you said, Hernandez has not been ruled out as a suspect, but suspicions continue to swirl, not only about his group of friends, but also about his allegedly violent past. Hernandez inside the play. Sources tell ABC News Patriots tight end Aaron Hernandez was seen partying with this man, Odin Lloyd, at a Boston bar Friday, just days before Lloyd's body was found in this industrial park a mile from the football star's million-dollar mansion. ABC News has learned the 27-year-old, a semi-pro football player from the Boston Bandits, was killed execution style. That a happy-go-lucky type of guy. We played on Saturday. Um, I spoke with him before the game. He was in good spirits. Sources tell ABC News that an SUV found near Lloyd's body was rented in Hernandez's name. This morning, investigators say they are looking for a silver side view mirror, which may have broken off a car in the area. Police have not said how it's linked to the case. The car is in your name. It's in close proximity to your house. So the combination of all of those things, I suspect Mr. Hernandez is feeling extremely uncomfortable at this point. Hernandez returned home quietly Wednesday, even as state troopers combed the roadsides leading from the crime scene to his house. Meanwhile, late Wednesday, lawyers in Florida refiled an unrelated lawsuit against the tight end. That suit claims Hernandez shot a friend in the face during a February argument in Miami, although no charges have been filed. Now, one more interesting twist in this case. The girlfriend of the victim happens to be the sister of Hernandez's girlfriend. Authorities are still trying to talk to her.